It is true that Saddam killed Sayyid Muhammad Bakr al-Sadr. But the Hawza, the Islamic institution, paved the way for the authorities to kill him. They were the ones that paved the way for the authority and for Saddam to kill Sayyid Muhammad Bakr al-Sadr. I can't mention everything in, in, in this lecture about his life. Perhaps there is there are some sense it is so it is a bit sensitive to to speak about certain points how he was oppressed even by the institution and some of the followers of the Marash. They used to refer to him as a writer in Arabic katib, although he is in that level of ishtihad, that level of intellect, that level of knowledge, but they used to put him down because of his age, because he's not connected to any office, and because they didn't like his new views that he came up with. Perhaps they didn't even understand some of his views. So they used to refer to him as a writer, or as a mufak, but not as a marja, not as a scholar. They forced his students to stop attending his class. You can read the book Sanawat al Hisar for Shaykh al Nu'mani or uh, Al Sira wal Masira for uh, Abu Zayd al Amili um, about the life of Sayyid Muhammad Bakr al Sadr. And there are some Western uh, writers who wrote about this story. They prevented his students from attending his class. They had to hide and go to the basement sometimes to, to study. They stopped the salary from his students so they don't attend his class. Not Saddam. Mawlana, the Ayatollahs did that. The institution did that. And not Saddam Hussein. This is the sad part. If it was the government that did that, then you can understand. But you can't understand when the institution and those, those who are in position of power in the institution did that. It is now Sayyid Muhammad Bakr Sadr that they cry for. And they have uh, conferences in his name after he died. Well, you killed the man. <laughs> you killed him. You destroyed his life. And now you, you cry and Bakr al-Sadr minna salama. Will you do the other latmiyad? Bakr al-Sadr minna salama. Why did you destroy him while he was alive? And I'm not speaking about one side. I said he was attacked from all sides. From all sides. 